Hello, my little chillers, my little chillabusters. Listen, I just wanted to take a second to say thank you. I know the show is only three months old, but it's been a lot of fun to shoot it. And I know it's still trying to find its footing, but we're figuring it out and it's been a lot of fun. And so I thought I would do a little best of, best of, best moments of 2022. Again, I know it's only three months old, but there have been some great moments. So thank you so much for a fantastic year. Uh, thank you for watching this show or anything else that I've done or TMG Studios has done. Appreciate you very much. And um, I'll see you next year. <laughs> I had a big crush on Cody, obviously. And I knew he had a podcast. Like he had mentioned it whenever I had met him. <laughs> and <laughs> not Something like that cool dude. Or like in the in the in the few weeks that's actually the I first thing him. he said it was really weird podcast host. Cody, i have a podcast <laughs> yeah yeah uh, nice to meet you cody from the podcast insanely chill which is a podcast by the way it was not like that you can find that wherever you get your podcasts anyway so i was like okay he has a podcast i want to see what it's about like what if he says something about me but then i was like he's obviously not going to but i you know like a little narcissistic. And I was like, what if he talks about me? Because we had a crush on each other. And so I was driving to work and I had it on. And I still remember like exactly where I was, like on the freeway. And you you were talking about Taco Tuesday and I was like so giddy. And then you said that. And I literally was like, oh my God, like <laughs> screaming by myself in my car, like holding onto the steering wheel, like, oh my God, oh my God. And I sent it to my friends. And I was like, listen to this time. This is what he says. Blah, blah, blah. I was freaking out. I was so excited. It's Wade here. Thank you for joining me. Uh, today, I'm very proud and absolutely thrilled to introduce my guest. It's my big bro, Zan. Zan. Excuse me. So, what's good? What's up? What's good? What's, What's good? Oh, you know the oh. Oh, uh, there you are. Yeah. What's good? What's good, What's dude? What's good, dude? Dude. Dude. You got a podcast and shit? I do. That's legit, bro. I know. Going yeah. up. Wow. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, man. <laughs> So, dude, you got a podcast. Yeah. That's sick. I know. Do you want a beer? Yeah. Oh, that's sick. Sure. I was wondering if you had any, like, refreshments. Yeah, man. Anything of that nature. Rona. Oh. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> it's Rona season, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? You have an opener? There's no opener, dude. Damn. I was not expecting for him to ask that. I don't have a beer opener. <sighs> Did I just mess up my own podcast? I think I have one. Oh, you know what, dude? What? Oh, I got one in my pocket. Oh, oh okay. Oh, dude. oh <laughs> damn. Damn, pa. Woo. Oh, man. Sorry about that, dude. No worries, dude. <laughs> damn, I was worried for a second. That's good, dude. Cold, right? That's super cold. And nice. Well, dude. It's been pretty rad just coming on here and like having a chance to straight up open up to you about life and all that. Oh yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah, for sure. Well, we still have like 58 minutes left. Oh word. Yeah. So it's a, it is a podcast. So. Hmm. So, well, dude, I really should be taking off. Oh, okay, for it's sure. Been nice catching up with yeah. you and, and all that for shit. For sure. But, uh, 
Big bro. I'm in there. I'm in there. All right, take the beer Whoa. for the. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. We all about that. Yeah, still plugged in. <laughs> just taking the beer for the road. Yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna post up here and just keep going without me. Yeah. Sure. All right. Yep. You had you had a uh, uh, one of my best friends uh, on the show. Um, Who? Uh, what's it called? I'm gonna call him right now. <laughs> what's it? What is his name? Oh boy. <laughs> Who the fuck? Your best oh, Obviously, one of your best <laughs> friends, <laughs> Jimmy Tatro. <laughs> oh yeah, dude, I you know I, him. Yeah. Oh, every time. Oh I, yeah, you've been in. Oh wait, no, I Which, haven't. Was he in a music video or something like that? Yes, he was in a music video, and then we've just like sort of stayed friends from like writing stuff and to each other and late at night. <laughs> <laughs> fan fiction. And yeah, like fan that. fiction. Yeah. But uh, uh, but it's so funny. Every time I run into him, he's always at Airwan, and he's like, "Yeah, dude, I'm just <laughs> getting a coffee, <laughs> <laughs> figuring my <your> life out." <laughs> <laughs> he, you know what's funny? What? He was literally the last person that texted me. Really? Look at this. Well, not the last because I mean I get I get hit up often Damn. by a lot of people. <laughs> but no, no, this morning he sent me he sent me um, the invite for his party. Oh, and then I sent him the invite for my party, <laughs> and he was like, "Damn, that's a good oh, invite." Oh, Dylan, He's you like, didn't get a. That's Dylan. a good invite. I actually was gonna invite you today after this. I didn't get that. I know. I felt weird about texting you because I'm like, dude, Wait, come do the podcast, and then I'm like, well, I also come to the party. Wait, but. You got a text from him saying to go to a soiree? Dylan's saying he didn't get I didn't Jimmy's get that. invite. No, but also it's tonight, and he sent it to me just now and said, came together late, and I was like... What time sure. did he send it at? Ten fifteen 10, 15 a.m.? Oh, Do you have your call phone? my best friend. I feel like we should call Jimmy right now call real quick right now. and see... Yeah. Like, He'll pick up. Yo, I heard there was a party. <laughs> he usually picks up on the second. <laughs> He's like, who is this? Sometimes on the third. <laughs> hmm. Oh, that's weird. He might be working. The third. <laughs> Not really, because he didn't he just text, he just you? text, text you again. <laughs> <laughs> no, t- at ten thirty an hour ago. He might be on Do Not Disturb. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Well, I would say that on here. So it doesn't say <laughs> that. No, weird. It says it on mine. <laughs> Hold on, let me just. Uh, it's like your number has been blocked. <laughs> I'm telling you, he, he picks up on and the. You're not invited to the Christmas party. He picks up on the second one. Yo, Dylan, we talked about this. You got to stop calling me. <laughs> yo, yo, chill, chill. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. No, no, no. Wait, uh, yo, yo. Wait, we were talking earlier this morning, right? Wait, what? No, dude. You got to stop calling me. I don't want to have to get the lawyers involved again. Seriously, man. Yeah, no, no. no wait, okay, I'll, I'll hang on. <laughs> what the fuck? How did you just do that? Oh <laughs> did you guys plan? <laughs> did you guys plan this sketch before? Ha- what just happened? Oh my God. He's my this, best this friend. <laughs> yeah, I guess sure. it depends. So I did, if I did they, feel like they, every time, uh, like every how time I they... talk. To, oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> I feel like the Zoom delay is just enough so that like I hate it. <laughs> I hate it. Yeah. Um, anyway, yeah. So that you go. No, you go. <laughs> I don't even remember what I was gonna say anymore. <laughs> I don't so know. Embarrassing. What am I supposed to say? My dog died. We just have to get rich enough where we can bring our lifestyles <laughs> with us, no matter where we go. Like The Rock, for example. Just Your travel bed? with a, one of those beds. Bed, yes. Yeah, just yeah, flying with you. Oh yeah. Mark Wahlberg does that. I saw a video where he was in shooting a movie in like London, and he had. The next room over was like shredded out, and he had a full gym in there and like three coaches. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, dude. It was crazy. Like, where if you, where if they? I always thought of this. Imagine he's like spending the night there. He's just there for two days, and they like shred the next room, build a gym, three coaches fly out. But he wakes up, he's like, oh, I'm not feeling it today. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, oh, okay, so we'll just we'll pack this up. <laughs> Like, how fucked would that be? I'm not even close to being at the point where I feel like I'd be ready to get married. <laughs> sure. Oh, my um, God. Like, I'm not. Like, I just I just started making my bed every morning. It's something I just started doing as a 26-year-old. I came as close as I've ever come in years to shitting myself today. Whoa. Today? Yes, today, this morning. I was this close. It was, like, coming out of my ass. What happened, dude? That's it. I mean, I, I, there was no like no, event. No, that no. I, just like I started to shit myself. With the lead up. I need the lead up. Well, I was Where like, okay. You? I was like, I, w- I did this. I did an ocean swim today, right? Yeah, yeah. So I ate a banana. Uh-huh. I go out. I swim for an hour in the ocean, which is stressful. 
yeah. mentally and physically, it's like taxing because you're scared, you're anxious, you're it's so hard. And then so you get you know you get out after water pouring out of your nose, yeah. And I'm like, yeah, I gotta relax. Let's go get some coffee and just chill for a second. Mm -hmm. So I pull up, get a coffee, and then I get a bar, and it has tons of fiber in it. And I knew that was probably. But even even before I ate it, I start to feel something in my stomach, and I'm like, "Should I ask? Should I ask if there's a bathroom here, or should I wait and, and wait till I get home?" And this Ooh. place is like four minutes away from my house. It's like I can what, what the fuck am I, I can't wait to shit in my own house. I got to shit in a fucking random coffee shop. I'm better than that. You're better than that. You know? Yeah. You're I, all I've better. eaten is a banana. I'm not. You know, stuff is settled down there. Yeah. Just something's. I'm getting some gurgles, some weird gurgles. Yeah. And then as soon as I left that place, I get in my car and I pull out of the parking lot and I'm like, oh, I should have asked them for a bathroom. Because it's it's now, it's now like one of those ones where you have to like hold back so hard yeah. that you're in like physical pain and you're, you're cramping because you're holding so hard and trying to suck it back up. Oh, I know. Dude. I'm sorry. This is so graphic. No, but, no. I know that feeling. And I'm like four minutes away from home still. So then I start just cruising i'm like i'm like blasting through four-way intersections just barely even touching the brake and i get i see my house and i'm pulling in the alley to pull in the garage and like it touched my boxers i'm pretty sure Oof. i was holding back as hard as i could and it's still it's it's still and oh my god anyways was it one of those I, moments where like you you come into the house and you just immediately drop everything on the floor? And I didn't bring anything in. The <laughs> coffees were still sitting in the car. My wet swimsuit was in the back. Everything was still in the car. The car's still running. I was just like, "Where are the coffees?" I'm like, "They're in that fucking car." <laughs> She's like, "What's wrong?" The worst part was I had to deactivate the alarm when I got it. So it's like, <laughs> that extra that extra twenty seconds was just pure hell. Yeah. That is the the depths of hell right there. Yeah. Do, 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 do. <laughs> fuck it up. Oh, fuck the code. <laughs> Incorrect passcode. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the Kendrick concert, you tend to like go to the bathroom at the worst times. Ooh. I try not to, but sometimes when I have to pee, I, it comes out of nowhere and I really have to pee. You know? Mm -hmm. Like I will, I will actually piss in my pants, you know? So I had to leave. There was like literally two songs that I wanted to hear and one of them happened as I was peeing. And it was like, it felt like the right time. Like it was like, oh, he's playing this song. You should be good. And so I went and I was not good. And then the other one, he just simply, he simply just didn't play. Yeah. Mm. He played the chorus and then said, that was enough of that. Kelsey was like, there's two songs I want to hear. It's these two songs. And she's like, I want to, I really, she's like jumping around, just doing her pee dance. Mm -hmm. And I was like, you just go. And she was like, no, but if I miss these two songs, I'm gonna be so disappointed. I was like, it's an hour long set. The chances are that he plays one of these songs. I was like, mansplaining, yeah, percentages, concerts. percentages and <laughs> odds and stuff yeah. like that, and <laughs> ROI and percentage. And <laughs> I'm like, the opportunity cost of going to the bathroom right now is astronomical. <laughs> Just go. You're never gonna get a better opportunity. <laughs> yeah, to yes. invest in your bladder. Yes, yeah. exactly. Yeah, right exactly. now. And so she was like, okay, fine. And she goes to the bathroom, and like literally, the door closes, and the song comes on, and I was like. No. Oh, God, God damn it. Speaking of Kelsey. Yeah. <laughs> did you know that she was in my second YouTube video of all time? Is it the dance one? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I did know that. Is she dancing in the video? She is. Yeah. She is, uh, she was obviously a cheerleader. Yeah. And we taught the cheerleaders the dance. Yeah. And so she is in, she is in the, uh, the dance. Is it still up? Oh, yeah. So people can go see that. People can go see it. The dance. The dance. There she is. Wait, which one is You see her back, uh, back right? Three oh, yeah. Yep, yep. There she yep. is. Oh, she's killing it. And there we go. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice. Now we're all in there. <laughs> she's still right there. <laughs> this really is the dance. This is amazing. Yeah. I don't know how we convinced the cheer team to let us. A teach, little stanky like that? Teach them this. Smell? Oh, we were all about the stanky like. <laughs> this is fucking good. You and guys we, choreographed this whole thing? We did. We launched this little so high. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> and there she is. That's Kelsey right on my left. Wow. This wow. is, that's hilarious. I wonder if she's going to be pissed that we showed this. 
Dude, we know how to do an intro. We really do. Didn't the last video we did together start with me being like, my dog died? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah, I think every time I listen to Mr. Beast on a podcast and he's giving advice for up and coming YouTubers, he's like, uh, the very first thing you should do is like give the viewer every reason to click off the video, like exactly. suck all the energy out of the w out of the room. Well, that's why he starts every single one of his videos with "fuck you" <laughs> or some super offensive like joke or something, <laughs> something racist right off the bat. Whoa! <laughs> oh what my hell? god! <laughs> but I am gonna be giving away a million dollars at the end of this video. Oh. oh okay. <laughs> Okay, you should have just started with that. Maybe that I sounds way around. more entertaining. Yeah, I think I'll stick around to see that. <laughs> you guys poop in front of each other yet? Yeah, I think it's gotten to the point where <laughs> she's... It was, like, funny when I would do it. Yeah. <laughs> but now it's, like, sh I hear, like, deep sighs when I go in the bathroom. Okay, so we have a we have a speaker. I blast music. Hey. I'll throw... You blast? Oh, that's sweet. I blast music. Okay. I'll run the sink. I thought you were going to say you have a speaker and you blast... The sounds of you shitting <laughs> yeah. out into the. I go live on my you phone. You would think like, that I'm that's over what here. Cody you're does. still gonna hear me. <laughs> a little megaphone that you just. <laughs> 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 not so, that we have to talk about pooping anymore. I know. That. No, I yeah. just not the ideal. Cody, you would think that Cody does. It's it's loud. It's loud when he goes in there. Hell yeah, dude! It is. You would think you would think like that, that I wasn't. That you did put your, a microphone. You just, you just called next to the toilet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. <laughs> But, you know, and then at first I remember being like, should I just, like, pretend like I didn't hear it? <laughs> like, like, should I pretend, like... And I go, babe, did you hear that? <laughs> you catch that one? Sometimes it's, like, just pretty, There's more where that came from! It's pretty violent in there, and then it just gets quiet, and I hear, sorry. <laughs> Let me show them the, the little beat that I made. Cody made a beat. This is so, it's so song. bad. This I feel like this can't be for us though. This is more no 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 no. This is just more of like a hardcore. This is our like when we like our couples. This is more more of our like Cardi B and Offset type song. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like the uh, what's a motorsport or whatever. They the one that they just did recently together. I didn't know. I didn't know they did a song together. Yeah. So that's, my little, that's my little beat. That, uh, I'm just. Again, that's how I know that you liked me. Because <laughs> you were like, this is good. This is good. Nice work. Yeah, I made a beat. <laughs> it's I, fucking crazy. No, that, but like, Cody, I genuinely thought it was good. Like, I w well, I think I was like, I wasn't like, this is going to is gonna be huge. But I was like, <laughs> it's sweet that he's like made a beat. It's fucking crazy <laughs> that like I see on on TikTok all the time, mm. videos about girls that are like, yeah, he just, we went on a date and then he invited me home to like yeah. listen to his beats. Right. And I'm always like, who would do that? Well, this is so <laughs> different than that. I guess me. This is different. The guy was like, you know, I don't want to see you guys on your back, you know, doing the backstroke. I don't want to see you doing the breaststroke. You got to learn to rest while you're freestyling. And I was like, absolutely not. So how do you do that? No. <laughs> He's like, you just got to learn how to be, you know, take it slower and be resting as you're freestyling, which... No chance, dude. Like a longer breath? Yeah, no. How, it's and I got in there and I'm like, I'm like, okay, straight to the breaststroke. <laughs> okay, you know? okay. And everyone, everyone's just, <laughs> people are getting kicked in the face. I'm like, go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. By the, you know, midway point, I'm on my back. I'm doing these ones. <laughs> you flipped onto your back? <laughs> yeah, because you keep the legs going like this and then you just. <laughs> so you were. Back breaststroke. Dude, I was flying. Honestly, <laughs> you were. the only thing I would have done differently, I would have done that more because I I was moving, dude. I was, I flew by. You invented I, a stroke. I, I saw a guy, he was doing this, and I just, I go flying by him. <laughs> He's like, what the fuck? I'll see you later, man. That's not a swim stroke. You just I, invented that. I, maybe I did. This is the Heinz Ketchup Collab, and what they did was they actually... They collabed with a clothing company called ThreadUp to release these garments. And these have pre-stained ketchup stains. So you can take a look. You can see pretty clearly here. She's got, she's got this ketchup stain. And they actually sell these. They call them the Vintage Drip Collection. This is sick. We should make pants with cum stains in them. Well, you know what's actually really cool, Cody? <laughs> no, you did <laughs> is that the Is that the joke? Well... There's no joke. Uh, this is not a joke. Heinz actually sent, they were nice enough to send us, um, here, let's, so we get the viewer at home. They actually sent us um, 
if you want to go ahead and that's that's for you, so you can keep that. That's that's the Heinz Vinches drip collection. This is real. This, this is real. real. They sent us this. Um, they, 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 that's catch. That's real ketchup. Yeah, no, it's it's legit. So <laughs> they, they, they 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 mailed that to me and they said we would love for you guys to promote this. This is stuff. actually this is real. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, it's not, yeah. dude. So you know what else is so cool? You just is- put fucking ketchup on this. <laughs> Okay. And you brought it in. Okay. All right. And for you to pretend like this is the real vintage drip from Heinz. They hooked us up, dude. I don't know what the big deal is. Isn't that sick? You just spilled ketchup. You were eating McDonald's in the car. You wouldn't wear that out? Here, let's... No, I wouldn't wear that out. It smells like ass. Tell me you wouldn't wear that out, dude. That's great. Okay, so so what's... what's I mean, that's what the shirt looks like. Yeah, I would, I would even say I did a better job. No, kind of did. That looks better. That's literally drippier. Like I like how like the oil is yeah. kind of seeping outwards. Yes, from the stain, so it's kind of it's like dual color. Yeah, I did this five hours ago, so I'm glad it's dried. Um, okay, <laughs> it's, not, it's not fully. Dried. It's not fully dried. Well, you're not going to be. Okay, so word got out that Heinz hooked us up, and Tostitos actually hit me up. Um, this is so cool, dude. This is so cool. This is the. Tostitos um, (laughs) queso fiesta shirt. I mean, how cool is that, dude? You got queso pico de gallo. I mean, you wouldn't wear that out in Venice, dude? Wow. At the brig or some shit? Yeah, that's fire. That is fire, right? I I love that. That blows Jerry Seinfeld out of the water. That really does. Yeah. Okay, so... so, Is there another (laughs) one? So so if you're not feeling the pico de gallo, you're like... (laughs) Please tell me there's another one. So... Okay, so for for the cheese lovers out there, they have an all exclusive. Oh, this isn't even opening. Oh wow. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna puke, dude. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna okay. puke. Oh, this is the queso lovers. Shirt. Why is that so gross? Again, oh, it's for Ryan. Is this this is for Ryan? <laughs> it's a small, so if you can fit in a small Ryan, this one's got your name on it. Uh, this is. <laughs> I want to again thank uh, Tostitos for hooking this up for us, dude. That is some, um, that is some stinky drip, man. Sti- that smells. Stinky. Pungent. But you know what the coolest drip is? You weren't um, kidding when you were like, this stupid bit is stinking up the whole office right now. I was like, what are you talking about? I mean, I walked in here and I'm like, okay, don't smell the queso. (laughs) So I think we're cool. But like, I knew this bit was going to be another hour and a half until we got to it. So, okay, but you know what's so cool is that... (laughs) um, What else is cool? This is the last one. This is the coolest one, I think. Um, So after Tostitos and Heinz got a hold of me, uh, word got out to Nutella that they actually... um, So... So at first glance, you're like, where? That's weird. That's the front of the shirt. Where's, you know, but Nutella actually hooked us up. Oh. So, so it. Oh, it's a back hit. It's It looks like you blew mud. Like, oh, you know, that's just completely really cool and like kind of almost uh, understated in a way. Yeah. This is like kid in front of a police station fighting for his life. Yeah, I like that. Um, Bathroom emergency. So That's yeah, those, amazing. So these are the drips that they hooked us up with. Again, thank you to Nutella, Tostitos. Is it? That is my that's shit. That's real shit. Yeah, that's real shit. That's poop. <laughs> it's been in my my reusable bag. <laughs> it's sanitary. Okay. You I sh- just you shit on this shirt for real, and you said it was Nutella as a joke. I came into this thinking you were going to be grateful <laughs> and appreciative. No, thank you so much to the brands. What was it, Nutella? We'd like to thank Heinz, Nutella, and Tostitos. And Tostitos and... Queso fajita shirt. Yes. Nutella uh, uh, chocolate shirt and the Heinz Thank you guys strip. so much. So happy that you guys are getting into streetwear. Yeah. Um, yeah. You know, I look forward to pushing, you know, the, the envelope forward, the fashion envelope. Yeah, by wearing these out in public, and uh, I'm really looking forward to that. So thank yeah. you. No, I don't Scott. do podcasts. You don't do podcasts? I, I do like very minimal amounts of podcasting. Really? Yeah. Well, thank you for doing this one. Yeah, I appreciate. it. I like doing it with friends. That's it. Okay. I don't want to go on a random one. I feel like I'm like, I yeah, feel like I podcasts are always like. So, How'd who you do you your... hate? Yeah. Oh, okay. Hmm? Yeah, because now they want that clip. Exactly. They want the TikTok clip. Yeah. I hate that. It's so bad. I know. Yeah. I feel like I'm. I. I yeah. I, I don't can want see that your either. questions though. I did that say who do I hate? Who's the worst yeah, yeah, DJ? Yeah, yeah. Can you delete that? Delete that. <laughs> so Dylan, what's your least favorite Lego? <laughs> it's got to be the one that's like a star. Clip that shit. Yeah, <laughs> we got him. 
The Star of David? That's fucked no! up. Man. Clip that shit. No. <laughs> it does not look like a Star of David. <laughs> you can't get me. And then everyone in the comments like, you have to watch the rest of the clip. He said the Brooklyn. 